Okay. Uh, I'm finally in the cemetery today. Just gotta take a quick look around. The little cemetery. Not sure how active it is. If there's anyone that wants to speak to me, I've been talking to my phone here. Come in peace. We should only look around here. A little bit overgrown to the Looks like we're getting to the uh, oldest section of the cemetery here. It's like 1904, 1908. There's like a whole family buried here. All different names. It's beautiful back here. But yeah, it is overgrown and no one seems to be taking care of it. Some graves all the way in the corner there. An old work shed. Is there anyone that wishes to uh, talk to me out here? I know it's probably been. Oh! I feel your presence. I don't mean any harm or disrespect. I'm just trying to learn. If there's anything you wish to say to me, you can speak. And in the background, I don't know if you can see it, but 
Over there is uh, West Rock. And that's the place where we're going to be exploring pretty soon. Oh yeah, they haven't done anything here. I haven't seen a uh, cemetery this bad in a long time. Oh, look at this. Looks like there's another cemetery. I think there is. I think these are like, uh, it's very interesting here. Oh, look. Or the small stones. It's very unusual back here. Oh, it's very hung on. So old. Several little graves. Spanish American War. Wow. They're just rows and rows of little markers. Can't really get close enough to see what they are. Oh. Let's see if I can get down here. I don't know. I don't know what these markers are. Does anyone know? Are these children? I can't, really can't see any. Wow. I'm getting the heebie-jeebies back here at this spot. I really don't know what this is. It's very unusual. Yeah, I dare not go down any further. Some kind of markers. Yeah, it's got a name. It's got Clark. I've never seen anything like this. It's so unusual. There's Clark. heard something. Okay, that section is weird. Okay, I see what's going on here. Okay. Oh, that's right. There's two cemeteries here. 
And then as you can see, uh, this is a Jewish cemetery, which is co somewhat connected to the other cemetery. It's very interesting. I'm not sure how far this goes, but uh, I think it goes pretty far. But right now we wandered into a Jewish cemetery, and as you can see, it's a little more ornate than the other cemetery. I do, I wish no disrespect here. Ah, oh, there it is. There's West Rock. That's where we're going to go soon. That's huge. That's a big cemetery. I think there's like two or three cemeteries that are somehow interconnected. This is like a Jewish one right here. Oh, look at that. Yeah, it's part of the Jewish cemetery right there. Look at that. Does anyone want to talk to me out here? Must get lonely sometimes. Yeah, sometimes I feel like I'm alone too. Oh, what a difference, huh? That's remarkable there. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. Look at that. That is West Rock. Over 318 feet. And we're going right to the top of it. Well, here we are in the Jewish cemetery. Just taking a quick walk through. Yeah, I just can't help looking over there. That's our destiny. Whatever happens to us, it's going to happen there. But here we are. Yeah, it's kind of a hazy day. The wind was blowing like crazy earlier. But the uh, wind has settled down. Yeah, this cemetery is definitely in a lot better shape than the other part. I just wonder if I can... I don't know what that is there. It's interesting, but... I don't want to spend too much time on this side. But this is another, yeah, this is an old cemetery too. 1906. Alright, look at that. I'm not sure how far back this goes, but all these dates are between like early 1800s, the 1900s.
But here's the dividing line. Eighteen fifty two. So yeah, this is a very old cemetery. Is there anyone that wants to talk to me out here? Oh, what a name. Clam? Really? Yeah, at cemeteries, sometimes you find names that you don't expect. Now, this one is, yes, pretty old. Uh, Crave, too. Uh, let's see. Uh, 1907. But yeah, there's a dividing line right here. I mean, half Jewish and half whatever else. Oh, well, we have some uh, famous names too. Well, we have Ford and Sturgis right there. Sturgis is, uh, I think it's a town somewhere here in Connecticut. Something. Oh, we found a Ford. More Fords. Ford Purvis. Oh, that goes back a long way in 96 year old Mason. Silas Ford. Eighteen sixty four to eighteen eighty two. Yeah, my math keeps flipping, so... Yeah, sometimes you get a little bit mumbled. But yeah, this is a part of the cemetery I wanted to check out. It's going to save the Jewish part for later. Oh, it's beautiful here, huh? Even with the sun the way it is. Got a hawk, got a hawk screeching. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen uh, videos of some of the uh, cemeteries in Australia and other places and God, they're nothing like this, huh? A lot of them are better. They take better care of their, some of their cemeteries than we do. This one, you can see, see the storm damage. Uh, we had uh, two pretty major storms that hit here about three weeks apart, not too long ago. And, uh, yeah, a lot of trees got blown down. Yeah, we need a road here in this part. Oh, hey. 
1874 on that one. It's beautiful back here. It's quiet, peaceful. I'm not picking up on anything, really. Ross. Catherine Lynch. Oh, look, it looks like uh, a couple of children died. 1893-1911 for Lewis. And 1894-1912 for Anna. Oh, this is an old one. Boy, they, yeah, these are old right here. Look at these three. They're very old. 1860. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. 1860 around there. Oh yeah, that's a very old design. Oops, sorry. Sorry for the bump. Oh, a tuttle. That's amazing how things, different things are between the uh, two sides of these cemeteries. The yeah, one side, you know, the Jewish side is pretty well kept. And this side is... Uh, It's not bad, 22 minutes out here. Yeah, I'm not really picking up on too much of anything out here. Okay. On. I'm going to try something out here. I don't know if any of you want to communicate or not. Let's see if I can find it. Where's the microphone? Oops, sorry. Okay, from Bluetooth. Is there any spirits that want to communicate with me out here? Do any spirits want to communicate? Yeah. 
Does anyone want to talk to me out here? You want to talk to me? Yes. I mean... Anyone want to talk to me? You can talk. Come on, talk. Whoops, did I screw it up? Okay, there we go. Thank you. It just turns down a little bit. You can talk. You really don't want to talk to you. I come in peace. Now these are old graves here. It's a very, very old cemetery. No, no one wants to talk to me? Not even a little bit. Hezekiah Hale, that's an old name. Sarah Hale. 1893, she died. Wow. So no one, no one here at all wants to speak. No. Maximum volume. That's odd. I'm not picking up anything really. Oh. Okay, I gotta check this out. Oh, wow. I to check these guys out. Yes? Did you say something about God? I heard that. What about God? Martha, Martha Bates. I know some, I think I know some of your relatives. And Marvin Bates. Marvin O. Bates. Hello. I didn't expect to find any Bates out here. Yeah, one of my friends. He's related to the Hates. And the Hates and Bates, uh, anyway, in Stamford, uh, 
they were kind of uh, intertwined. So yeah, I'm gonna let him. I'm gonna let him know that you're here. That's a pretty big surprise. And it took him about thirty minutes. I'm not picking up too much on here. So you can see I have my handy dandy new speaker here. And my brand new speaker. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Oh, what's this? This is old. Hello. Oh, look at this stone. Yes. Oh, look at this. This is really ornate. Well, I've, never, I've never seen one like this. Damaged and what happened to it? Yeah, very ornate. I've never seen a stone that ornate before. That's pretty unusual. Let's see. An old stone. 1861 is one of the dates. Yeah. Do, you, do you mind me being here? Am I in danger of coming out here? Or don't you care? Ah, you're talking about men? What about men? I heard that. It's like you haven't seen the man out here in a while. This is a very old cemetery. It's doing good, 34 minutes. Say whatever you want. Yeah, they did a little work out here, but not much. 
Does anyone know what's down there? Why, why, why are those graves like that down there? They can't, they, they, they can't all be children. I don't understand those graves. The small ones. Were those, were those people that died in World War II and uh, were buried elsewhere? It's very, very unusual. All those graves down there. I don't understand. What do, what do you know about all those little graves down there? Are those just markers? Yeah, a little hot, a little humid out here, but it's not too bad. Okay, thank you for talking to me. Those of you that did try. Powering yeah, off. Yeah, I'm gonna turn it off for now. Oops. Okay, I don't need that other phone running. Power that phone down. Okay, I'm just gonna just gonna set this down for a minute in the grass. So I can put my some of my equipment away. There we go. That one so bad. We still got to visit with the grave for a minute. Yeah, it's just getting kind of humid. It's supposed to rain, but not really till like one, two o'clock in the morning. Uh, yeah, I really, really want to come out to the cemetery. I don't know if there's anyone famous here or not. There could be. But that I really don't know. Ah. Yeah, another mason. Down to Nevertz. Oh. 
some more another Ford. And now there seems to be a uh, quite a few masons here. Oh look at this. We have a root. Oh, look at that one. Okay, huh. we're going to uh, probably wind it up in another five or ten minutes. Uh, I'm not sure if this is going to be uh, a one hour special or what, but. I just wanted to come out and get the feel of the place. But it's really interesting. There's some names you don't really hear that much. You hear like uh, Cornelia, Jeremiah, Esther. At one time uh, they were probably pretty common names, but not not too much anymore. Uh, excuse me, pardon me. Okay, we uh... Oh, look! Mansfield! Yeah, that's the name of uh... Street in like uh, quite a few towns up here. Like I know there's a Mansfield in I think Norwalk, one up here in New Haven, I think, and um, a couple other places I've seen it. It's like a pretty good sized family and. Oh, wouldn't you know, uh, back in the corner there, well, Carlisle, Mansfield, uh, another Mason. <clears throat> oh, look at this. Huh. The stones don't look too badly damaged, but, yeah, that tree went through. Yeah, there's some pretty high winds right up in this area. Okay, we have Dockham. We are proud. December 4th, 1806. H31. Okay, I have friends and relatives that are pretty close to that. Another good old Sagittarius. Thirty-one years, wow. That's young. Whew. Oh, look at the line in the sky.
Let me hang out here. Forty six minutes. Okay, we're almost out of here. Two, a couple more minutes. There's got to be a bus stop somewhere. Forty-seven minutes. Oh, these are new. 2012. Nineteen ninety three. Oh, wow. Find oh, another way out. Awesome. I didn't know there was another way out of here. Let's go over here for a minute. I'll be hitting the bus stop and Couple minutes. That's the bus stop I have to go to, right there. Nineteen forty three, nineteen twelve. Looks like a mixed marriage here. We'll definitely come back and uh, do another exploration here, but it's getting uh, <clears throat> getting kind of late here. It's getting close to five o'clock, so uh, we'll just take a quick little view around. Well, that's very unusual. Okay, that's it for now. Um, I'll talk to you all when I get back. Uh, like, share, su subscribe. I'll talk to you later.